SAGE is a comparative study of aging in six middle-income countries, including China, India, Russia, South Africa, Ghana, and Mexico, and is designed to look at aging patterns in a number of different countries with different levels of economic development and different population sizes. SAGE is led by the World Health Organization, um, but involves you know, scientists uh, and, and researchers within each of the home countries, but is also designed to produce data that's then made available to researchers around the world. Basically, the takeaway message we found with this study was that sleep really does matter um, in all the countries and all the cases we looked at. So the different variables we were looking at, we were looking at sleep measure two different ways, looking at sleep duration, so how long people were saying they were sleeping, and then also their self-reported sleep quality, so how, how good they felt their sleep was. Um, we looked at this in relation to a battery of cognitive tests. So we used five different tests, uh, immediate and delayed verbal recall, backward and forward digit spans, and then also a verbal fluency test. Um, so and we found even while controlling for education differences that there were these very strong patterns and that uh, specifically having these, this low sleep quality as you might expect was associated with having poor cognitive function or reduced cognitive performance on this specific battery of tests we used. We found that women reported longer sleep durations but poor sleep quality and they also exhibited uh, lower cognitive performance on these tests. Although when we did control for education, it seems that that was really the deciding factor. Women were receiving less education in these countries, as you might expect, and therefore that really seemed to structure these cognitive differences. But the sleep patterns are, are still there and are very, very real, and so that could also play a role uh, in this cognitive decline we see. One of the exciting dimensions of SAGE is that we're building towards the third wave of the study where we're integrating a genetic component and that's going to involve collecting saliva from all the participants in the study so that we can look at the genetic factors that influence aging in these populations.